Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I'm here with 17 hours left for Valentine's. So let's get into it. No time for anything. If you like this video, please leave a like, because it helps me out. Today we're going to be Chaco grinding, because I held this off the last day, so I have close to 40,000. Let me actually just check that. Shout out to Gay for Edison right there. Showing up. Uh, let's see, I'm 30,000 away. <laughs> I, was, um, I started yesterday, I was like... Uh, at three million and now I'm much more so I'm the current setup I have requires waiver I need waiver with like the double god damn you Merlin I fucking I hate if you have a waiver use waiver waiver is better than um, Merlin for my specific purposes Merlin's good for like when you need to cheese a boss but when you actually legitimately need to um, uh, kill things, it's just so much easier to have double waivers because you can just automatically give a unit 100% MP charge as opposed to a waiver and a Merlin. Well, of course, this all changes if you have Merlin yourself and you have a waiver yourself. It would change for me if I had my own Merlin, to be honest, but, you know, you make do with what you got. All right. So, as always, we start with um, our boy here. He's going to blow himself up, as he always does. Uh, what's our setup today? We have um, Stella, we have Arush, we have Assassin's Kathach, we have Double Waver, we have Bunyan, and we have, I believe, Skathach just in the back because she needs to get, she's close to like, I think level 10 in bond points, so she's just like grinding up bond points while I'm doing this. Uh, as you can see here, my Bunyan is level 100, <laughs> so she's extremely buff. Um, usually at this specific stage, I like having Skithatch, um, be the one to kill this, this specific route right here. But that's not gonna work out because I got very unlucky with my, um, card rotation, so we're gonna have Bunyan do it. Um, I can easily three turn when it's, Skithatch is the one doing the killing on this round and, um, not Bunyan, but, you know. <sighs> Alright, let's go in here. Good thing about Bunyan is that she's super quick. Literally, she takes like I think her NP is only like a second or two long. Let's let's count it. All right, one, two, three, four, five, and it's over. She has the shortest NP in the entire game. I think. She beat the crap out of that chocolate tiger. And if for anyone who doesn't know the context of this, um, Semiramis. The oldest poison empress who made a bunch of chocolate. So now everyone has chocolate. I hate this specific Mo because she is immune to having her um, a negative effect applied on her. So she can just automatically see look like that. It makes it really hard to do what I want because it's super annoying to have to deal with. I will activate Beach Crisis and hope that I get. I get it right in the in the coin flip. That's what I was trying to say. I can't believe I got all three bunions. If she, literally, a Skizatch does not kill uh, this turn. To activate her 50% NP, I don't think I did. That's unfortunate. That's what I get for talking. But I believe Waver should be nothing to attack, and that should be uh, pointless. There's no reason for him to be attacking anything. He's not going to be able to kill uh, Mo in any capacity. Really? I lost the coin flip on that one with a 60%. Okay, thank god. I did activate it, okay. Oh, okay, she should be able to kill. Because uh, Bunyan's skill one also has a crit up, so come on, kill. Oh, son of a bitch. And this is why I don't like Mo. That move right there is the worst move in the entirety of anything when you need to grind. Who, what kind of self sadizing bastard puts a evade on a grind boss it is maybe the worst thing is that she will always use it turn one doesn't matter what you do especially if you deal any damage she'll always use it so now this is basically just a big ass waste of time um just because we got super unlucky because it literally if she had the defense down and she killed my bunion just for fun of it but it doesn't matter because she's dead unless i get all waiver i didn't get all waiver there you go oh god 
fate, you are a cruel bastardizing. The, also, the other problem with this cassette right here is that she's really good for basically one turn, but as soon as that turns to gone, she's kind of useless to me. Oh, man. I should also show... Oh, she got her bond up. Ooh, two sink forts. All right, I'll take that. Uh, all right, some decent stuff. Let me see, do I have enough for... I think I need 160 for the next level of my um, my Chaco station. Let me see how it is. Oh god, this loading. Loading. Thank you, god. Why do you take so long, Fate? Uh, let me see, I need 160 and I currently have... What, 36? Nope. Going in here. And then we're back at it again. I got lucky on that one. Okay, so... Uh, I forget the name of this thing. What is it called? The imaginary element. I forget what this thing is actually called. There's like a shorthand for it. I use it. Uh, kaleidoscope and the black rail on Bunyan. That'll make it so Bunyan does a crap load of damage on her NP. More than she already would. But the reason I have it on there is because that stupid ass Mo has unbelievable- Mordred is her full name. I just like calling her Mo because it's shorter. Um, and it's also her nickname in one of the story events. Which one is it? Which one do they call her Mo? I want to say it's Summer they call her Mo. Hmm, has to be. I don't think they do it in England. Or London, I should say. Uh, perfectly fine rotation here. No need to try and get anything up. Boom boom, Stella, up in the face. I wonder how long yours is. Pretty close to it. He's also level 90 for these, these purposes. I would turn him level 100, but it's fine. He doesn't need the 10 extra levels to do what he does best. He arguably did not need those levels, but I gave it to him because he deserves a gold border. She, he's one of the best servants out there. At least in my opinion. Oh, once again, we get super unlucky. I've been basically been doing this for two days straight. It is exhausting how much bullshit grind there is in Fate Grand Order. Um, but here we are. I hope you. I hope your Chaco thing was smarter planned out than mine was, and your pulls were better. I had literally, by the way, um, I don't do summon videos on Fate that much. When I do, they're always terrible because it is what well, Fate has maybe the worst summoning in any game. Period. It doesn't matter if all the units are usable in some way. Uh, that doesn't change the fact that its rates are bullshit and it takes uh, extreme luck to pull anything. Um, but with these Samurami's pulls, I think I did maybe one or two multis. Didn't get even the freaking new three craft essence. I got nothing. I basically got um, a kick in the dick. That's as far as I'm concerned as what I got. I oh, she got 4%. That's nice. Alright, so let's see. Will you play nice with Mimo? Will you be stunned? Will you have your defenses down? Okay, so I should be able to kill pretty easily here. I'm not going to activate her crit up because she has like no chance to crit on anything that's an- Oh, actually. I'll do it for the um, the chance on the buster. Alright, let's see. I should- if she crits here, she should be able to kill her. Okay, that means she's basically dead. That's a full rotation right there. Gables! Look at her. Such a pretty one. It's a shame you can't get this unit anymore because I really like her. Oh, don't tell me you're not gonna kill her. Oh, you. Are you at. I have to check later if she's at full 1000, by the way. She might not be. Because of how old she is. I want to say she has to have be fully fold out though. And have all of her foes in her. Also, by the way, I think I've done this node maybe close to a uh, hundred times. Did not get any of the craft essences to drop at all. So, you know, the worst luck imaginable. I'm also I'm getting all this useless ass chocolate that I don't need because I didn't have like a buttload of. I had, I think, 20 something new female servants and four new dudes. So I really did not need any of the chocolate here. Kind of a waste of time, but hey. 
Uh, I guess this is for newer people, but if you're a new player and you didn't... Actually, that happened once to um, Nabe, is that he had to do that. Alright, so, boom. Increase, increase my Chaco production. I'm at 93. I'm completely out of stuff to spend um, on my Cuckoo Kako, so that's done. Uh, let's see. 28. We're close to that crystallized lore. I should be able to finish this out. Um, even though I think I rush every single um, fake grind at the end. I don't know what. I don't know why I do it. I think it's because I literally can. Fate is one of the worst grinding experiences in the world, but also um, it's super easy to actually do, I think. Because uh, you can do it in like two days if you're a freaking crazy person. Which I am. Why am I a crazy person for this game? Quetzalcoatl. She's fantastic. She's the greatest servant that Fate Grand Order ever made. That was specific to Fate Grand Order. And I'll fight anyone who says otherwise. And that's just the way it is. Alright, let's go in here. Alright. There's no real reason to do that, I just like occasionally getting crit stars. There you go. It's completely random bullshit if I'm going to have um, Bunyan or not. I think literally I, this might just be that I'm going to get Bunyan for a third time, even though I said it's complete random bullshit. <laughs> man, look at that pose, because that she's doing is just like too intense, man. She needs to like, calm down with her. We're in like a battlefield of pure fire, and she is not letting down <laughs> with like the chest out. Uh, of course, it's Bunyan again. Okay. Wait a Dota. Wait a Dota. Oh, really? He hasn't said Dota once? Wow, and he's using the ones that I'm not used to hearing him say. Say Dota. Say Dota. Say Dota. Thank you. There's the Dota again. He was just having stage fright, that's all. Tasty, tasty. And then. Wham! I'm doing this one because I want to see if I can get some more crit stars. The more, the better for Skathadra over here. This is the Pioneer Spirit. The moron. Dead, dead, dead. Wham, wham, wham. I wish I could change the chainsaw, because I like her Bunyan's first, I think, Ascension the best. Um, but I like the chainsaw the best out of everything she has. Oh, Mo. Please, for the love of God. Please be kind. Get stunned. Thank you. I do the stunning just in case um, I don't kill her this turn. And if I don't kill her this turn, then she automatically uses the evade, which is a waste of my time. Um, uh, sure. There's a 50 50 shot. So let's go in here. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, let's do it again. Also, for this setup, I was using. Um, uh, Cleopatra, but Cleopatra is weak compared to Skip the Hatch because she has MP level 1 and this one is a 5. So she just can never do enough damage. Which is a shame because I really like her, but, you know. On crit. Still not enough though. Nope, not enough. It's okay because Bunyan will finish her off. There you go. Yeah, and you see that amount of damage she did right there? That's why you want to do Skipatch first, first and then um, lead into Bunyan. At least that's what I think. Alright, alright, not bad, not bad, not bad. Duh. I think I'm at... No, I'm not at the next one yet. I need to see, do I have enough for a level up in the facility or not? I don't know, let's see. Let's find out. As soon as it's done loading! Uh, no. So, last one. And then we'll call it a video. And that's it from Fate until the Hanging Gardens or whatever the hell. The Secret Garden that's coming. The Garden of um, Sinners, which is a terrible event, but great if you love um, whatever Kids Next Door, KNY, whatever it's called, Shiki's uh, series. Yeah, Key and Y, which is, um, Kids Next Yard, actually, that would be, because, no, it's K and D, that's Kids Next Door. So it's Kids Next Yard, there you go. Kids Next Year, there you go. Check it out. Um, 
something something the garden of madness travis touchdown all that good stuff all right let's see can i i just want to get good luck once i want it to return it once i just need the good luck uh it doesn't look like it'll be real good luck this time <laughs> Yeah, it's a shame, because she's so weak that, uh... Oh, before this ends, I have to check to see if she's a thousand. She has to be. There's just, like, no way in my mind she's not. But, you know, you never know. Ooh, three. Yay, through kit, through kit stars. Crit star? Crito? Oh, I'm tired, man. I'm sleepy. I've been getting a cold and stuff, so it's not the greatest. Uh, oh, yes, okay, we can do it. All right, so we're gonna do same thing as last time. Build up, build up. Now here's the thing, which is 100% possible. I could get nothing but waiver cards the next, um, my next go. Which if that happens, it will have effectively ruined this entire rotation. Which it's a possibility. Basically, I didn't want two Bunyan Berserker cards there. I wanted um. Uh, what's the word I was looking for? I wanted something else, but again, I should be fine. Let's go in. Crit star game. Alright, come on. Kick his ass. Take it to the land of shadows. How come she has so many game bulges? No, it's probably because she's shit back. Miss, or miss needs to kill. Rip! Oh. Chakamaro sounds like a chocolate version of Akamaro from Naruto. At least to me. In my head. Hello, Mo. We meet once again. No waiver, no waiver, no waiver, no waiver, no waiver. Yes! That works out perfectly fine. So, we're going to beat the crap out of Mo. There is absolutely no reason for me to um, worry about anything. I'm gonna still use this defense down. It won't matter. Okay. She's dead. That's three turn. Chama. That's a big overkill. And dead. Yep. All right, everyone. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you. I wish you luck with the final. By the time this goes up, there's still gonna be some time left. So if you haven't finished grinding, grind up like crazy. And I will see you guys in the next gacha video that I upload. And again, if you like this video, leave a like. If you're watching this and you haven't subscribed to me, hey, I play Fake Grand Order. You should totally watch me. Even though most of my stuff is usually just grinding or whatever. Um, I think I'm pretty fun. And even though half my videos I think are just using Arash and Bunyan. Actually, if I look at the vast majority, I'm pretty sure it's all that. So I'm going to activate this just because I promised to show off. See if she was 100. It's gonna bother me. Eh, fine, whatever. And then, um, she has to be 100. Yeah, 1,000 out of 1,000. How close are you to being finished? That's a long ways away, my friend. Anyway, goodbye, everyone. Have a nice day.